In accordance with the principles of law number 27 of 2005 on education, issued by His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa bin Salman al Khalifa, the King of the Kingdom of Bahrain, education is a right guaranteed by the kingdom to all its citizens as an element to personal prosperity, development, and well being. Basic education is a right for children, which the kingdom is committed to providing, and parents and guardians are bound to uphold. In an effort to ensure the provision of education to children who are unable to attend school for long periods due to medical needs, Bahrain Trust Foundation introduced the school program Alimni as a hospital school model applied around the world. The first hospital school in the Kingdom of Bahrain was inaugurated at the Salmania Medical Complex in 2017. The school has two classes, the first in the Pediatric Oncology Ward 202 and the second in Ward 31, which is designated for children suffering from different medical conditions. The official opening of the school under the name Dina Kanu Micro School was in 2019 with the support and sponsorship of the respected Mr. Muhammad Ibrahim Al Mu'ayyad. And to continue to support the education of children with medical needs, the second hospital school was established in 2022 at the King Hamad University Hospital. The hospital school program Alimni provides several educational services to hospitalized students to support their education and develop their academic skills in addition to exploring and refining their academic and creative competencies. The services are provided within the hospital and outside it. The hospital school is a single, multi-age classroom which includes children of different ages, abilities and backgrounds and where the teaching emphasis is on the student as an individual. Modern teaching methods such as project-based learning and learning based on the STEAM approach are adopted. The STEAM approach promotes self-learning and collaborative learning in a variety of ways, the most important of which is modern technology. The program also provides several services to students and their families inside and outside of the hospital. Such services include an assessment upon admission to the hospital school for the first time, in which the student's level of basic skills in different educational subjects is evaluated through an electronic portal. Arabic, English, Science, Mathematics after the assessment, remedial courses in core subjects are offered along with training the students on the skills required to complete one of the following six projects. Who am I? I am a skilled cook. Around the world. The green city. I design my city. I open my shop. According to the STEAM project-based learning approach, which consists of five stages. Reflection, Research, Discovery, Application, Communication In case of children being unable to attend the classroom in the ward, the activities are provided by the assigned facilitator in their hospital rooms. The program also provides different types of activities for students while they're outside the hospital, in addition to providing psychological counseling sessions for all students and their families. Kindergarten students benefit from a school entrance preparation program as well as remedial courses in basic skills and a number of training workshops, educational and awareness sessions. This adds to the students' participation in a monthly contest to showcase their projects via the hospital's school Instagram account. Celebrations on national occasions and events are also held. Workshops for students and their parents are regularly organized with field trips to recreational centers, government, and private institutions. In order to achieve the educational goals of the Alimni program and to support the development of the curricula in microschools, the organization in collaboration with the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities and the University of Bahrain, organizes a story writing competition for children and youth every two years. Thus far, 18 stories have been published over the three cycles of the competition. 
We at Bahrain Trust Foundation are proud to have received great support from the local and the international community in the hospital microschools project and in the programs that we offer to the community. Through community partnerships and the support of civil society groups, volunteer teams, and individuals, the program offers chances to deliver educational, psychological, and recreational services to hospitalized kids and their families. Thank you to everyone who put their trust in Bahrain Trust Foundation. Thank you to all our supporters, donors, volunteers, and collaborators, both inside and outside the Kingdom of Bahrain.